Hey, my name is Marvin Harms. Uh, I'm one of the instructors here at Professional Development. And I'm talking about the camp class on plants today. My grandkids are here, Carter and Emily. And one of the lessons we have is on how much, how many different plants are in a uh, meter, square meter of, of grass. So they're in the process of trying to figure out if there's more than one kind of plant. But if you look at my class, they're arranged with uh, a welcome, and then the syllabus, the grading, the grading rubric, and all the directions to uh, do the materials. And then you'll note on, after each lesson or experiment in plant class that there are forums and I have an explanation how to go to the forums there. Okay, also in plants, um, you'll find if you are able to dissect it or get a model like this from the uh, audiovisual department of your district, it will show the different parts of the uh, internal part of the plant, the uh, sepals, the petals, the uh, flowers, the, the stamen and pistils, and uh, pistil and stamen. And so this will be a part of that. And then there's also a uh, the cell. The plant cell obviously is, is uh, rectangular or square, whereas the animal cell is round. And so it shows the different parts of the uh, cell. Now I've done this with uh, just build, make uh, uh, bake a cake and just put these various parts in it and explain it to the kids and let the kids eat the cake afterwards. But there are different ways, and I have different ideas that you can use on how to uh, present the plant cell and also the animal cell. Another lesson is different kinds of leaves. So Emily and Carter both picked different kinds of leaves. And uh, there are different vein structures, different size, different shapes. And so this is a lesson that you can have your children do just by going out and picking up the leaves uh, around the campus and just trying to figure out how they're different, how they're similar. And this is an exciting lesson. So a part of plants then is to uh, just to give the kids a, a acquainted with all the plants and how important they are to us as people. And uh, so welcome to this class.